YouTube, JC Talks. I remember my last reaction, it was a girl cheating on her man. Now we finna see, you know, the boy cheating on her man. Cause, all right, let's get into it. Why is boyfriends loyal or not? We'll just call him Z. We set up an elaborate plan to get Z to this home to find out if he would be willing to cheat on his girlfriend with our decoy Tessa. Tomorrow. What? You gonna leave me out here? I want to prove it to you. Are you gonna join me? Before finding out whether or not Z passes this Yo. test, you guys gotta see how we got here. I thought he was going to do the talkies intro. Two days intro. ago, we All had right. Anilia convince Z to pick up an iPad that she supposedly bought off Tessa. Hello? Hey, is this... Yeah, who's this? This is Tessa, Nalaya's friend, the one she bought the iPad from. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up? Just wanted to make sure you were still coming by later today to pick the iPad up. Yeah, I'll be there. Okay, sounds good. Tessa texted Z to meet her at this nearby park. We made our way there 30 minutes before their scheduled pickup time. Alrighty, guys, we are in position, and we are now just waiting for Z to arrive in about the next 10 to 15 minutes, I want to say. Yeah. She look good. She look good. Like, bro, like... It's just crazy to me when I see dudes cheat on like attractive girls like this. I'm like, yo, like y'all just be fumbling, bro. Like I don't understand. Like look at her. Like real talk, look at her. Like <sighs> Z ended up taking a lot longer than we thought, but eventually he finally arrived. Hello. Oh, she's jumping on the phone here. Oh really? Uh, I don't see you. Okay, she's looking around. Oh, I see you. You're on the other side. Yeah, I'm here, waving my hand. Oh, there he goes. Is that him? When I buy stuff online and stuff like that, like, I can't just meet up with somebody. And if I do, I'm taking somebody with me. Because, dog, you just never know, bro. Like, I can't. I ain't trying to get kidnapped out here. Swing. If he looks this way, just duck. duck. Okay? Yeah, I'm trying to hide. Windows are tinted, but just in case. Hi. <laughs> This man being nice spotted, you. I'm bro. Tessa. And just like that, we've gotten Tessa and Z to meet. Now, what you guys don't know is that Tessa has also asked Z to do her a favor. By the way, didn't Elia tell you about the other thing as well? The, um, like giving you a ride to sell cars or something? Yeah, is that still okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I, I don't mind. How far is it from you? Like 10 minutes. I'll give you gas money and everything. All right, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I'm with it. You see, Tessa is posing as a flipper. We wanted to see to give her a ride to flip some trading cards so that she could plant her Yo, jacket in let's his Let's go car. back since elementary, bro. She did. Yeah. Are you still cool with uh, taking me? Yeah, 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 I'll just go right now if you want to. That would be amazing. I can give you the address. Okay, he's taking her. He is taking her. you will be emoji. We are in phase two. Can I put my stuff in your back suit? So with that, Tessa removes her backpack and her D's back seat, exactly like we wanted her to do. I'm crying just thinking about this. Oh, are you, you're crying? No, no crying. <laughs> they might drive past us, so just, uh, I'm gonna put the camera stay down. Low. Just kind of duck, yeah, stay low. <laughs> okay. Yes, sir. Hey, hey, they are headed your way. They should be there in about 10 to 15 minutes. He only calls whenever he needs something. Why does he just call to be like, hey, how are you doing? Everything is good. This is pretty much phase one. We are now in phase number two. two. What's up, you guys? My name is Ken. Today, I'm going to be purchasing some Pokemon cards, or as some like to call it, cardboard gold. I need to find a side hustle now. Okay. This isn't willing to give me a raise. I wonder if Ken knows that I make more than him. Usually, I ask a friend to come with me, but like I said, they're all busy. Yeah, of course. So are you like trying to get rid of the stuff you don't need anymore, or what? No, this is what I actually do. What do you mean? Uh, reselling things. I go to thrift stores, garage sales, eBay. Oh, what? What? Is he doing push-ups right now? What the heck? Okay, I'm not gonna lie though. Ken's looking pretty buff today. Damn. Hey, yo. I don't have any trust for him right now. I've caught him in girls' DMs multiple times. He's very friendly. Even around, like, people I trust. Every time I try to talk to him about something, he... Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, that friendly stuff is gone, like, you feel me, like, it, if you're just being too friendly, like, you're opening too many doors for just something to happen, you feel me? He's always blowing me off, like, you're crazy. Okay, here she comes. Excuse me, are you Ken? Yeah, yeah, hey, what's up? Oh, hi, I'm Tessa. From Off Road? Yeah, I have the trading cards. Yeah, I've never I cannot, caught him. Yeah, I cannot do that, bro, like, bro, <laughs> like, just meet up with random strangers that I don't know, dog. Nah him with a girl even though he's like 
texted girls. I've never caught him with somebody. Mm -hmm. But when I bring it up, he says he's totally clean. I mean, what if these girls are really like just his friends? I don't think they are. The way he'll text them, the way he acts when he gets around them, it's just, it's not friend-like. Oh my gosh, you have stealing the plans? Where did you get stealing the plans? Ken doesn't strike me as a trading card type of guy. This looks fake, I don't know about this. Oh no! Hold up, hold up. Okay, no, no, I see it, I see it. I just was Y'all into anime? Like, don't get me wrong, I'm into anime, but I'm not like that deep where I'm like into like cards and like, you feel me, uh, cards and um, what's that thing called? Manga. Like, I, I like watching anime, but I don't know, like, y'all into anime like that? Cause I know anime is like popping and like people got, you know, these little Pokemon cards and people watching manga and things like that. I don't know, let me know. So on a scale of 1 to 10, like how confident are you that he's going to pass this test? That he's going to pass the test. I would... Dad, she got so no like faith. Four. Oh, wow. A four? Bro, a four? That's a 40% on the test. Damn, bro. What you been doing, man? Oh. Yeah. Really? I feel like he just goes for anybody at this point. Have you ever considered just like breaking up with him? I have, but I don't know. Yeah. I can't do it. Those are Pokemon cards? Um, no, um. And a word of advice for y'all, when a girl's like done with you or when she's gonna break up with you, she, she doesn't think that on the spot. She already thought that like months prior. You know what I'm saying? Like months prior that, oh, like, like I'm doing this thing. She just, she just like stayed to see like maybe if you could do better or if like the, her situation could be better or she was just trying to see like what benefits she can get. You know what I'm saying? JC talks. They're different trading cards. Bro, what the hell kind of cards are these, man? Cause these ain't no damn Pokemon cards, bro. They're like off-branded Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Ken just texted me, headed your way. Okay, perfect. Okay. They are headed our way, so they should be here. Eventually, Z and Tessa made their way back to the park. Oh my God, he's literally parking to you spot. <laughs> Yeah, so. Thank you so much for everything. Yeah, no problem. I got Here's you. $20 for gas. Uh, <laughs> trust me, I don't need it. Thank you. No, please, take it. In case you guys forgot, the whole point of all this was to get Tessa to plant her jacket in Z's car. You see, we needed a way to get Z to come to Tessa's supposed home. And what better way than by getting him to return the jacket that Tessa forgot in his car? Did she leave her jacket? Did she yeah, leave yeah, she didn't have it. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> We're good. Ooh, we're set, we're good. And just like that, we had a reason to get Z back for phase number three. What? Oh, <laughs> are you kidding me? <laughs> God, he told her to get your jacket out of my car. Thanks. At first glance, it appears that her plan is ruined, but the reason I'm laughing is because it's not. With Tessa's jacket being so poofy, I figured that there was a high chance that Z might notice it. So we ended up planting some AirPods that Tessa would drop as a backup plan. Tell me you dropped, you dropped the AirPods, right? I did. Okay, okay. good. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> I told you, see, something literally told me. What if he notices your jacket? The only downside of having dropped the AirPods is that Z's gonna get a notification on his iPhone telling him that someone else's AirPods are traveling with him. I mean, honestly, I think we'll be really? fine as long as we could pull off phase three in like the next, know day, that. next two days. I agree. He'll just basically know that he has your AirPods, that's it. So he might text you or call you up and say, hey, you left your AirPods in my car. If he does do that, then just tell him, hey, can you think you drop it off tomorrow or the next day or whatever? This is it. This is it. How are you feeling? I'm nervous, but I'm ready. Okay. These headphones are for you so that you could listen in to like what's being said. Okay. We were now in phase three of our plan. Tessa had texted Z inquiring about the AirPods and after some strategic and cunning messages on her end, Z had agreed to drop them off at her supposed house. So how was yesterday when he uh, gave you the- Had agreed to text Z inquiring about the AirPods and after some strategic and cunning messages on her end, Z- I mean, I ain't gonna lie. He, he, he just kept it simple. Like, Lamo, I got you, you feel me? So far, I don't know. I don't really see no no cheating, but you know what I'm saying? Like, he had agreed to drop them off at her supposed house. So how was yesterday when he uh, gave you the iPad? It was good. He just handed it to me, but he didn't even bring up the AirPods. Oh, he didn't bring up the AirPods at all? No. Really? Yeah. You think that means something? I'm hoping it doesn't. Yeah, he might have just thought Probably. it was irrelevant. Uh, <laughs> that don't really mean nothing, bro. Like, 
it's just AirPods. It's not. It's not really that serious. Like, it's not. Like, it's not like the girl left a piece of clothes in her car or something like that. Like that, because like obviously, like if I tell you every little thing, you're obviously gonna worry. You're obviously gonna like. You feel me? Like that's why it's not always good. Like even when you're in a relationship, to always check, you know, your girl's phone or vice versa. Like to always check your dude's phone because you might just end up finding something that you don't want to end up finding. You feel me? You know? Yeah. Or maybe you <laughs> genuinely forgot about them. And That's what I'm thinking. After waiting for some time, Z finally texted Tessa that he had arrived. Oh, here we go. Hey, park in the driveway. Oh, it's late at night. Yeah, come on. Now remember, guys, Z only came to drop off Tessa's AirPods, so convincing him of park in the driveway was one it's step close. It's like, it's like eight, nine o'clock? ...them to come inside. We don't have, unfortunately, a live feed of the driveway, but you can still hear, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey! What's up? What's up? Look what I have. Oh my god. Oh, look what I have. And all Tessa had to do was convince Z to come into the house. What are you up to tonight? Nothing really. I'm just chilling. Just chilling. I have plans. Okay, now we're going to get into the juicy part. One of my friends later on tonight, so. With a friend? What friend? You don't know her. Maybe I do. Whoa, 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 whoa. You don't know her. Did he just say her? I swear he just said her. Did he just say her? I have plans with one of my friends later on tonight, so... What friend? You don't know. Okay, this was pretty You crazy. don't know. He said that he Yo. had plans with a her later on tonight. Now, he could just be referring to a friend, a family member, or something, but being that we're pulling a loyalty test and that later on would it be like 11 p.m., we had our doubts. It honestly really sounded like that, but to be honest, I couldn't really hear if he is hanging out with a her. Like, who's her? You think he's referring to you? No, he's not referring to you because he literally just told her you don't know her. Who is he referring to? Who is her? Well, come inside. Come hang with me. Come inside? Yeah, come have a drink with me. Have a drink? You can just have one drink. Come inside. Okay, what are we going to do? Tessa succeeds in convincing Z to step inside for a moment. In doing so, she is now one step closer to making her move. Welcome to my home. <laughs> yeah, do you live there alone or do you live with your family? I actually live with roommates, but none of them are home. I mean, Tessa managed to convince him to come inside. You don't know anything about like someone that he was hanging out with later on tonight? No. Could it be didn't. his mom? Could it be his sister? Yo, 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 bro. <laughs> you do why, bro? I, like, bro, stop with the dumb questions, bro. Like, I don't, bro. What do you mean if it, if it could be his mom? If it could be, come on. He literally said you don't know her, a friend. Like, why? Like, why would he? You feel me? Like, obviously. Like, bro, if it's, like, his mom or something, he would have said that. If it was his sister, he would have said that. <laughs> a good friend? No, he didn't tell me anything. Do you want something to drink? What is that? It's a mixed drink, vodka, and OJ. Do you have anything else? Yeah, I have cranberry juice. Yeah, I'll take some. How strong do you want it? Not too strong. Not strong. Yo, cranberry juice be, bro. Cranberry juice be slapping, bro. I ain't go, oh. Okay. <laughs> so like Remember, just be slapping. I ain't lie, bro. You guys, we do not condone drinking and driving. Do not drink and drive. Despite the Facts. fact that Tessa was on her way to making her move, Facts. Nelia couldn't shake the her out of her mind. I'm trying not to like jump the gun. Uh -huh. Like maybe there's an explanation, but I want to know who her is. Do you want me to tell Tessa? Nah, you gotta see more. You gotta see more. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna text. And so with that, we coordinate a secondary plan. Cheers. On top of making her move, we now wanted to test it to find out who this mystery girl that Z is planning on seeing tonight is. Sent it. I'm sure she'll read my text soon enough. If she doesn't read it soon, I'll like literally keep texting her and stuff. It actually took a while for Tessa to pick up her phone and read my messages. You see, on top of making her move, we wanted to know if Z would be willing to go back to the room with her to, you know, do stuff. So Tessa was in full on character, breaking the ice and trying to make everything come off as natural and as realistic as possible. Do you want a refill? I'll leave you take another one though. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, and these, they're getting another one. Oh damn, this is not good. Cheers again? Yeah, cheers. So how is it this time? <laughs> Better than last time. <laughs> I just taste stronger. <laughs> you really want me to stay, huh? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> you want to get comfy? Go back to the couch. After you. Okay. Tessa okay. spends okay. ten minutes doing her job, but she still doesn't see my text messages. So I decided to just blow up her phone. 
Did she respond? No, she hasn't responded. No, I'm pretty sure she's just gonna read my message, but I don't think she'll reply. I think she'll just like see it. A hundred text messages later, Tessa finally sees my messages and instructions. Let's see what she can get out of him. So, um, you said you're gonna hang out. <laughs> See what I'm saying? Like right there. Instructions. Listen Let's to what she what said. She can get out of him. So. Let's see what she can get out of him, bro. Like, so she's literally gonna keep baiting and baiting and baiting and baiting this man, bro. Like, and this is what, bro. This right here is what literally turns like nice, genuine people into just heartless people, bro. Like, you feel me? When they get hurt, I really want to trust people no more and stuff like that. And like, bro, like the face that she's giving right now, like. She's literally like on that verge of just, you know, lashing out. What do you do when you're together? Um, adult stuff. Adult stuff? Yeah. Nah. You want me to go? Why? I want you to stay. But I gotta go. Can I ask you an honest question? Yeah, what's up? How long have you been seeing her for? A couple of months. Wow. Yeah, that's a long time. <laughs> I don't know if it's the alcohol talking, but you're super attractive. Thank you. You're fine too. <laughs> and stay. Nah, that's reps. Oh my god. This dude, bro. You see what I'm saying, bro? Like, she keeps baiting this nigga, bro. She keeps. And this is, I'm, I'm telling y'all gentlemen, this is what girls will do. Like, they will keep just, just, just baiting you, bro. Just baiting you. I'm telling y'all, y'all gotta be very, like, just strong. Just like, no. No, baby girl. Like, we're not doing this right. We're not doing this. You feel me? But he already folded. Like, he already, he already, he already folded. This is. Really? Yeah. For a second, it seems like Z was about to turn down Tessa's offer, but he just asked her to prove it. Something she as a decoy would normally ask him. You a free time. You free? Mm-hmm. No, you not. How would you know? Because I've been with multiple freaky girls. Yeah, you gotta prove it to me though. So, what's up? <laughs> I can't even, I can't even listen to it. It's arguable whether Z has failed or passed this test, but I think it's pretty safe to say that he's talking to another girl on the side. Like, he's more worried about getting her upset over Nalaya. There's still one last step to this test, though. Remember, we gotta see if Z's willing to go all the way with Tessa. Well, let's do it then. We'll do what? What do you wanna do? What do you wanna do? You told me let's do it. So what are we doing? <laughs> no, you tell me. It's your house, not mine. I don't even know where the bathroom is. <laughs> Ah, bro. Hey. For what? You gonna leave me out here? I mean, you said you wanted me to prove it, right? Are you gonna join me? Yeah. No. Nah, bro. Folded, man. Come on, man. Yes. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Okay. Make yourself comfortable. I'm gonna okay. go make us some more drinks. <laughs> I'm just gonna. I'm gonna make us more. Drinks. All right. I'll be right back. I'll be back. So in the end, Z decides to step into the room and have a good time with Tessa. Now I really want to know your guys' thoughts. Do you guys think Z passed or failed this test? Nah, he failed. Personally, for me, he failed that. Bro, what? Failed that, man, bro. I mean, got an F, F, F minus. <clears throat> if that girl has some self-respect for herself, that girl should just leave. You know what I'm saying? Like, me, I wouldn't even tell the person, yo, like I'm done, like I'm, I'm, I'm out. Like, I would just, I would just completely like ghost them, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. Like, that, that's, that's what I would do. Cause ain't no way, like, you doing this and like, nah, bro, nah. Yeah, I'm a little conflicted because I think it's bad that he went into the room, but I can also see how alcohol played a role into that. Not trying to give an excuse for him, I'm just thinking to myself, huh, I've done some pretty dumb stuff while drinking too. Not this dumb, but dumb. But then again, I look at it and I'm like, the man only had two drinks and he's tall as hell. So if anything, he's only buzzing it. He's not even drunk yet. So did the alcohol cause this? I should have just- Man, even then, even if you drinking, bro, no, bro, no. 
birthday. I got drunk, like crazy drunk. Like I'm talking, like I'm flying off the board, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm over here, I'm over here doing push-ups. I'm over here like doing all types of, you know what I'm saying? And I still like had conscious of what I was doing, but I was just doing it. You feel me? But bro, for you to get to that point, like you literally have to be like, I'm talking like blacked out, like just you feel me? Like you can't if you're drinking, bro. Like you have control. Like you have control over like what you're doing 30 percent capability of like okay like i'm here okay i'm not just blacked out drunk you feel me listen to everybody when they told me about him but instead i took his side such a liar do you want to walk in there and confront him and tell him everything that's happening do you want to i want him to know you want him to know yeah you want, I want him to know everything? everything yeah what if you went in there and you confronted him on your own first because he's expecting literally Tessa to come back right now yeah. and walk in that room and please him. So like, what if instead of Tessa walking in there, you walk in there? No cameras, no nothing. You walk in there and you see what he says. Do it. Let's do it. You want to do it? Let's do it. You feel safe going in there by yourself? I mean, we'll be here watching and so if anything happens, we're running in there, you know? Yeah, I feel safe. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. And so with that, Nalaya decides to confront her boyfriend about everything. I hope you guys have your talkies for this one because you guys already know. This shit's gonna be good. Where'd you come from? Yo. Where did, come from? <laughs> Where did you come from? Why are you here? Why are you here? Stop. What, what are you doing? Stop. What do you mean? What Why you are you from? here you in Tessa's here? bed? How can you be here? Can you just tell me? I'm tired of you lying to me. Like, I know. I'm not lying. You haven't even let, let me speak yet. You're not You're saying always, nah, anything. No, 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 Like, you're not finna, bro. It's when people get caught, like, doing something, they get so defensive and, like, so, like, bro, don't, don't be doing that, bro. Like, just, uh, you knew what you was doing. You feel me? You in another girl's bed. Like, I'm gonna keep it real. She's out of your league, bro. I, I'm not even gonna lie. Like, attraction-wise, the fact that you even playing with that, come on, man. Come on. Saying Are you gonna anything? Let me talk? Are you gonna let me talk? Go ahead. Tessa? Well, I, I just said one word. You're talking about. I see you. You're always cutting me off. Let me speak. I haven't said anything. Why are you here in Tessa's bed? Just answer the question. Can you I can't speak? tell me anything. Can I speak? All you can say is, "Can I speak?" And then when you do speak, you don't say any words. She is drunk right now. She's tips. She had a bunch of shots, and I dropped her off home. When I dropped her off home, I came here. She said, "Okay." She, get, she offered me a drink, okay? Mm -hmm. And I and I took it. So how did you end up in her bed? Because I'm too drunk to drive home. You're so full of shit. You're such a liar. You lie about everything. I've lost so many people because of you. Tessa. I've lost so many things. Tessa can't. Tessa can't. You know no, what? Tessa, Tessa you know what? Hear you, right? I know Tessa. everything. Tessa. Nah, uh, bro. Nah, 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 nah. Oh my God, bro! I can't, bro. What is this? You know, you've been caught. Oh my God! I knew so, like this is gonna happen, bro. This entire thing. Sure, you thing knew this was gonna, gonna happen. Phone tested, so your girlfriend wanted to find out if you're truly loyal to her or not. So she wanted to set up a loyalty test. So we had Tessa basically ask you on a date, pretend to be into you, all yeah. that stuff. Are you serious? So this entire thing was basically a loyalty test. Oh, uh, I didn't see that. Yeah. yeah, you did. Nah, 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 nah. You, you, you definitely did. You definitely did, bro. You, you, you were flirting. You literally were about to like do the do if she ain't walk into the room. You know what I'm saying? Like, you literally, you literally said yes. Like, let's do it. And then, the, and then there was another girl that you talked about saying you don't know her, and that's not her. So you cheated, bro. You got caught. Accept it, just yeah. I've heard it come out your mouth. Like, aren't you drunk? Aren't you drunk? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why are you smiling? Why are you laughing? Don't blame Tessa. Blame, blame yourself. You see this drink? Blame yourself. I was literally, I was literally drink. I literally drank my two of these. Why are you still laughing, bro? Because you got caught. I mean, I only had two drinks, but like, are you gonna drive? Because if not, we can call you an Uber home, dude. Because we're not gonna send you, we're not gonna send you home drinking and driving. You know, like I mean, you have two drinks. No, you're not. You're not riding with me. No, you're not riding. Anything, we'll call you an Uber home, dude.
No, they will call you an Uber. Yeah, I don't want about. you. We're done. Let's let, let's call you an Uber here. Come on, come on. You fumble, bro. Let's, come here, let's I talk. Swear, no touch. You fumble, dog. Where is this? I haven't even been in here. Alright, oh my bro. god, what is this? Alright, bro, it's time. Come here, bro. Come on, And like, the thing is, he's taking it as like, bro, like, you're literally taking it as a joke. Like, bro, you obviously, like, you obviously made the girl feel some type of way. Like, you feel me? Like, if you really cared, like, you wouldn't be sitting there laughing and joking around. Like, you would at least have the decency to be like, damn, like, I messed up. Like, you feel me? Alright, well, alright, alright, alright. I don't know what this man is doing. Like, don't be like this guy, bro. I don't know what this guy's doing. That man trying to forcefully do like all type. No, no, bro. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. <laughs> all right, dude. Hey, I can't tell how much of you is really drunk, dude. Or are you are you fucking around? Or are you really drunk? Don't touch me, bro. Are you really drunk? Or are you fucking around? You only had two drinks. You literally only had two shots, dude. Hey, come on, bro. Hey, don't touch me. Chill, bro. Nanaya. All right, you're gonna get that. Nanaya. Bro, relax. Right, stop, 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 Let's go, let's go. Hey, stop. Stop. Okay. You want this to happen? You want you want us to do this, Nalaya? Come on. You sure you want to do this? I take both of you. Yeah, now I'm trying to figure out, like, is this man abusive? You feel me? Because, like, the reactions that he's given, a time where females will literally, females will literally tolerate an abusive relationship because they're trying to save the guy. They're trying to make him a better person. Stop doing that. Stop trying to save people that don't want to be saved. Because situations like this, you know what I'm saying? Like, if these two if these two dudes weren't here, like, you know what I'm saying? If these two dudes weren't here and it was just them, God knows, like, what happened. You feel me? Like, if you see this type of aggression or you see these type of patterns, run away. Be gone. Take whatever you got to take. Drive three hours. Whatever, like, whatever you got to do, just be gone. Be gone. Save yourself. <laughs> I don't know how it got to this point. Nobody was helping me. I was clearly struggling. Ken just watching. Cameras just filming. Yo, 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 look at his face. Yo, <laughs> yo this dude's oh, face. This man is throwing it back on me and taking advantage of me. Come on. I'll take, take both of you. Yo, this dude's a menace, bro. Could you really get drunk off of two little drinks like that? Yo, this dude's right, hey, actually a man. Yo, bro. I take both of you. Alright, chill. Alright, chill, chill, chill. I take both of you. First chill, one. You want the smoke? Right, sir, sir, keep it you want it too? <laughs> Honestly, like, look at that got it now. It looks like Ken's the referee in this freaking fight, bro. He doesn't do jack shit. <laughs> He's just walking around and just like, alright, alright, chill, chill, chill. That's all he does. You want to go, sir? Right, chill, chill, chill. You good? Bro, we're gonna let you up, okay? You chilling? I'm gonna leave. Oh, shit. Give me my key. Give me my key. Uh, that's, oh, shit. I honestly couldn't tell if this man was really drunk, if he was acting, or if he got caught and he started acting dumb. I don't know what it was. It seemed like from one second to another, this guy's brain just kept switching. He switched from one girl to the next girl, then he went from calm to violent, and he went from violent back to calm. And then he just walked out. <laughs> That's what I get for making sure that he doesn't go home drunk. Bro, what the fuck were you? Where the fuck were you? Is it over? <laughs> <laughs> Is it over? JC Talks. Peace.